Hey there, Geeks. Tim Tibbets here with MajorGeeks.com. Today we're going to show you how to add Windows Defender to the context menu in Windows 10. If you didn't know, the context menu is when you right-click. This is your context menu. As you can see, I've tweaked this a little bit. I have account settings, display settings, personalized. And if you're interested, you can go to MajorGeeks.com and actually click on the Appearance section. Let's see if I can find it over here real quick. And we added a context menu category here because there's so many of them now and we got tons of great stuff in here and you can do stuff like what you just saw here neat all right let's get this going this is as easy as applying to registry files and there's a 99.999 percent chance it won't cause any damage to your computer which is you know pretty good so here's what we want to do we want to apply these registry tweaks we want to click here to download it just click on download now Wait five seconds and the file will automatically download. It might even be less now. There it is. You can close that. Check the video description for the link. Add Windows Defender Antivirus to the context menu. Double click that. You have two choices. You can extract them. But because they're just registry files, we can just execute them from in the zip file. So just go ahead and click Add Defender Context Menu. Click Run. Click Yes. And finally, click yes one more time. And click OK. Whew. Exhausting. All right, here we go. Let's see if it worked. There it is. So now you can get at your Windows Defender antivirus. You can open your Windows Security. You can Windows Security and Settings, Update, Quick Scan, Full Scan, Offline Scan. Cool, right? So it gives you a shortcut to not having to come over to here, find your way around to whatever you want to do. It's a quick right click and you're there. So that's it. Now, change your mind. We're going to do the exact same thing, except we're going to hit remove and run. Yeah. Uh-huh. Okay. And it's gone. There you go. If you're not confident with a registry you should be okay you can always back up your registry of course and there you go I think we covered everything it's pretty easy to do right there you go always have a few similar articles if you found this interesting regarding Windows Defender and that's pretty much your quick tip for the day we're under three minutes and out of here see ya